Now, this is how bad I am. We've got sport relief at the end of this week, okay? And sport relief, comic relief. I don't know if they're still going to do the thing of celebs going to Africa to do the sad stuff, okay? I think it's probably, they probably should stop doing it, but in another part of me, I really want them to continue, because that is still my ambition as a comedian. <laughs> to get big enough that I get to do the sad stuff from Africa. <laughs> I know how shit that sounds. I know. I know if I ever made it to that level, I'd have real trouble containing my glee. I know. <laughs> I'd be something like, well, standing here amongst the street children of Uganda, I think it's hard for people in Britain to realise what a massive break this is for me. <laughs> Genuinely not nice people. People think I'm nice. First of all, because I'm Tubby. Who is Tubby here? Me. Yeah, love fat people in the gig. Thank you for coming. If it's not sold well, you make the room look fuller. <laughs> and also, people think you're nice if you're Tubby. They also think you're nice if you're middle class. Because middle class people are trained, as I am, trained to distract attention away from their privilege by being all sweet and putting themselves down. You watch middle class people in action and go, oh, that's a big house you live in. Oh, it's very messy. It's very messy inside. That's a nice car you got. I got a real deal on it. Well, it was free from my daddy. <laughs> <laughs> Olivia Coleman winning an Oscar. Oh my gosh, how's this happened? How's this happened to sweet little me? Oh gosh, how's this happened to sweet little humble me? Oh my god, Lady Gaga. Oh, Meryl Streep. How's it happened to me? You went to private school, Olivia. Made it about ten times more life. <laughs> I'm not having a go at Olivia Colman. I love Olivia Colman. They're, they're all Benedict Cumberbatch, Eddie Redmayne, Phoebe Waller-Bridge, Tom Hiddleston, private school, private school. I, I went to private school and look where the fuck I am. Here, <laughs> Any private school people? Yay! Yay! All of the back. No, we're not sure. They're totally embarrassed. It's a nightmare. It's in fact, I just say to my dad, private school is wrong, it is terrible, I should leave. Then I'd sit down, watch Grange Hill, and think, oh, maybe just one more year. <laughs> Because us private school kids, we used to watch Grange Hill like other kids watch Doctor Who. We're like behind the couch going, Oh, it's Gripper! Like that. <laughs> you knew if you were a little posh kid you wouldn't survive Grange Hill. You knew it like, Alright, Gripper, Tucker, Pogo, who are you? I'm Hal, lovely to meet you. <laughs> Dinner money now! Dinner. To you that's lunch. To me that's supper. What are we going to do? 